Sanwaneños of all ages are splashing water onto passers-by using their water guns or water containers. Definitely, no one is safe. You must have lots of patience when you pass by San Juan. Otherwise, make sure all the doors of your car are locked as some people will try to open them while holding buckets in their hand. At 9 o'clock this morning, a watercade around the streets of San Juan, led by city officials, doused residents with water. Their parish priests bless the water from the fire truck and people who get wet believe they are blessed. This is actually a recreation of the baptism of Jesus Christ by St. John the Baptist in the River Jordan. While San Juanenos celebrate this tradition to douse others with water, there are some rules to follow. Only clean water is allowed, ice cold water or hot water is not allowed for today's festivities. Lots of activities here. Residents join the street dancing competition and Santong Tao float parade. Now let's hear what some San Juan City residents and even foreigners have to say about this festival. Sightseeing, it's a seaside town, so festival. We we want to go to this festival. Where is that? 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 If you're going to work or aren't ready to get wet, do make sure to avoid the city of San Juan every June 24th. Otherwise, go to this place and have some fun by wetting yourself at the Araw ng San Juan. Rex Remitio, CNN, Philippines.